Welcome to Grammar Bites. In this video, have to and don't have to. Let's start with the form. For positive sentences, as you see, with the subjects I, you, we and they, we use have to. But with he, she, it, we use has to. This is normal for have, has in the present simple tense. For all subjects, we then add the infinitive of the verb, verb 1. For negative sentences, we follow the present simple pattern again. For subjects I, you, we, they, we use don't have to. With he, she and it, we use doesn't have to. For all subjects again, we add the infinitive, verb 1. Now let's look at how we use have to and don't have to in sentences. We use have to or has to plus the infinitive to talk about something that is necessary. The teacher tells the class, you have to finish your homework by tomorrow. And the teacher has to check the student's work. We use don't have to, or doesn't have to and the infinitive to talk about something which is not necessary. Take these guys here. They don't have to work tomorrow. She doesn't have to wake up early. We can make questions with have to by adding do does. Do you have to work this evening? Does your mother have to use this table for dinner? We can also use WH question words. Here are some examples. Why do you have to study now? What do you have to learn for your exam? When does she have to leave? Let's put the questions, positive and negative sentences, together and talk about these two guys. Who has to wear a uniform? He has to wear a uniform. He doesn't have to wear a uniform. Does he have to be in bed before 8pm? No, he doesn't have to sleep early. Yes, he has to be in bed before 8pm. Does he have to help people? Yes, he has to help people. Now it's over to you. As always, there's a link below the video for extra practice. Have a great day.